This is the RTU 5015 plus board. Now we start to test. Firstly, we power on. And now we can check the LED. This is the MCU LED start to flash. And this is the GSM LED start to flash quickly around twice every per second. Now it is collecting, already collected to GSM net. But we'll keep it. And the MCU LED after powered on, it also will be kept lit for around 3 minutes. During this time, you can send RESET reset command to reset the password. And after this reset time, the board will not accept the reset time command. Okay, now it's already collected the GSM net. And now, firstly, we will search use our APP, RTU5015 APP. Firstly, we need to go to the device list menu. Select your device. Okay, we use this. And firstly, we program the number which is used to control the board and also can receive the alarm SMS or power failure alarm maps. That is the first authorized number. Okay, from the authorized number setting. We firstly, we set up the my phone, this mobile phone number to the device. Okay, this is number one. Okay, now we press number. Send the SMS. Okay, we can check the MCU LED and the SMS. Here. Received the SMS, the MCU LED flash quickly sometimes, and the SMS LED will start to flash slowly to show sending the SMS. Okay, now we received the response. The MC. Now we start to test the power off alarm. Okay. But we need to wait around three minutes after the MCU LED start to flash, then we can power off. Because just after power on, during the set timer, if you power off directly, even the battery cannot power the board. Okay, now we wait the MCU LED start to flash. Our tester is 12 voltage. Okay, during this time, all LED is kept lit. No flash. We just wait. Okay, now start to flash. That means we can do the power off. Okay. We Pull out. Okay, send the SMS. Wait. Okay, power off alarm. Relay is off. Okay, we already finished the test. Thank you.